Welcome back Woodlovers. It's a brand new day. It's a brand new word. It's certainly a new word for me here in the workshop and one that uh, you don't typically find in the workshop of a steel string builder. This comes from our friends at Stumac and we are looking at Cupressus sempervirens. That's right, Mediterranean Cypress. And uh, this is very lovely and like um, most uh, timbers in most species in the Cupressus uh, genus, they have a really lovely scent to them. Really lovely. Reminiscent of um, something like camphor or uh, red cedar, something like that. Very fragrant indeed, very, very kind of spicy, very peppery. Lovely, very aromatic. This is a word that, uh, as the name suggests, is found all across the Mediterranean region. Um, you may also know it as Spanish Cyprus. Um, similar related species, we have Monterey Cyprus that actually grows here in the UK, as does Mediterranean Cyprus. Uh, you, you can find it in the UK. It's also related to, and I didn't realise this until just now, Lalandi. So, you know, those horrible, massive trees that very quickly grow way out of proportion and are impossible to take care of. Uh, they're, they're especially prevalent here in the UK. They're, they're actually hybridized in Wales, of all places. So let's blame the Welsh for the horrible tree that is the Lelandai. Um, Mediterranean Cyprus is related to Lelandai. So now I'm looking at all of the Lelandais here in the garden and um, looking at them, thinking about back and side sets. Um, so who knows, maybe I'll make a Lelandai guitar. Wouldn't that be novel? So um, Cyprus, more, most typically associated with flamenco guitars. Um, and uh, the reason being not so much for the, the tone, but because it was so widely available um, in the Mediterranean where people are building largely flamenco uh, guitars. So this was sent to me by Stumac. They are advertising this as a back and side set wood for Steel string guitars, um, which is a new one for me, but there's absolutely no reason why uh, you, you wouldn't choose this. And I'm actually thinking that with these sets, I might try something a little bit different and use it as a top wood. Um, it's not significantly um, uh, more dense than spruce. It's a little bit harder. Um, so on the Janker scale, it is 560. European spruce is more in the kind of 450 region. Um, specific gravity, so the density is 0.54. Spruce is kind of around about 0.41, something like this. So a little bit more dense, um, a little bit harder, but there's no reason why you couldn't make a soundboard from it. Interestingly, the modulus of elasticity, the modulus of elasticity is half what you would get um, with with spruce. So it's um, it's interesting. I think this could make a really really cool topwood. Um, so maybe I'll make a top wood. I'm also considering um, using this as a substrate for a laminated back, um, going down the kind of traditional route, the kind of, um, you know, back in the era of Stauffer, you know, he was doing a lot of uh, laminating of kind of tropical woods onto things like spruce and, and mahogany. And, um, you know, I'm wondering this, if this might make a really nice substrate for um, laminating something wild onto. So. Let's give it a little tap, shall we? Now, I was reading whilst doing my research that it has a tap tone of wet cardboard, and I just I just don't think that's I don't think that's a fair or accurate characterization. I think it's got more going on than something like walnut or mahogany. Is it kind of in that ballpark? Yeah. It's got some cool stuff going on. It smells amazing. This is a really nice quarter sawn, very straight, very even, very uniform set. And uh, let's give it a little squirt with a magic spray. Yeah. really nice. Another related species is uh, Alaskan yellow cedar, which you can probably guess from the, uh, the colour here. 
So interestingly, um, cypress trees can grow, uh, can, they're, they're really long living species. They can live for on average 1,000 years. There are some ancient uh, trees in Iran that are estimated to be about 4,000 years old, which is, uh, which is old. So there we have it, uh, Spanish cypress, Mediterranean cypress. And um, this was sent to us by our friends at Stumac. It was requested by Frank in the comments. Um, so I hope you are satisfied with my uh, little talk through on, um, on Cyprus. Yeah, another material that I'm anxious to start working with. I've got lots of ideas for this. Ah, oh, man, all Cyprus and all Cyprus guitar. Wouldn't that be, wouldn't that be fun? So there you go, Cyprus. We'll see you tomorrow.